can't see me. Let's go. What up, what, what, what up, y'all? You can't see me here today back again. You already do what it is. Today, we back on Car Mechanic Simulator 2018. If you watched my previous video, I wanted uh, everybody to vote and let me know what car they wanted me to restore. I have four, but the three ones that uh, I think most people want me to do is the Ford Mustang, the Salem Spectre, which is actually a Camaro, and the Boat Rectilia, which is a Corvette. Looking like it's going to be the, the Vet or the Camaro, but I have been getting a lot of votes. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to work on this car, which is the fourth one, kind of as a test car. Because I haven't really done a restore and I don't know what all it takes. Um, I spent about this car value price down here, the fifty three ninety three. It's about 5 G's or so uh, for the car. Engine value 13. So what I'm going to do is see how much it costs. We know it's around five, around fifty-five, and see how much I can actually make, because you supposedly can make good money off of restoring cars. Um, I know they've been patching and doing a lot of uh, work on the car, so it may have went down some. Don't know for sure. Um, I also was trying to figure out how to get the engine out the car, and I figured out that here's the crane. Um, they actually have the engine stand. And I thought you just hit the engine stand, but you actually got to hit the crane to get it out. So I think I'll do that. Let's see if it'll let me take that out. We'll start here. Uh, I'm not sure if that's A or B. I think that is B. Yes. Well, when you take it out, you actually don't see it on the stand. You just kind of know that it's gone. So we'll pull it out. Okay, to remove first, unmount the gearbox from the car okay so I gotta unmount the gearbox from the car so what I'm gonna do is we'll go ahead and move the car over to the lift and then we'll go ahead and move this over by the car just so to be ready all right before I do that I'm gonna go ahead and just take everything I'll take the doors off move this whole frame bro and some car um, some parts I have I may even go to the junkyard see if I can collect more parts but some parts I have some I still need to get Let's see you take that window that windows already missing the front window Yeah, I don't know how to take the whole body off, but um, hmm. if you know, let me know in the comments if you know how to get this whole body off of this thing or if it just stays rusty dusty. Go ahead and remove these tires. Get these tires off of here. Ooh, brake drum looks horrible. Brick shoes, brick shoes. As far as body with the Salem Flamo. I said this thing like a gremlin. <laughs> I think it may be like a some type of Nissan or a Toyota. The old hatchback. I think what I will do since I don't oh, you know what? I only got 13k. I don't even know if I have enough to <laughs> To replace everything in its entirety, or if I'm gonna have to kind of cut out and do some jobs. That's a good question. Good question, that we will answer. It's 13,000 enough to rebuild this car in its entirety. Hmm. And I may or may not even put this up, but if you're watching it, that means I decided to put it up. And if not, you know, you won't know anyway. And so it doesn't really matter. It don't even matter though. Let's get this uh, sway front bar. Sway front end bar link. What, doggone it, what is it again? Sway bar front end link B. Front suspension cross member B. I'm gonna get that front suspension cross member B just so 
we have it there. You know what? Let me see if I can repair it, actually. Let me see what all we can repair. Let's see what all we can repair. We might can repair some of this stuff. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Ooh, great repair right there. Doggone it. It disappeared. Oh. It's all right. Steering rack. Calipers, calipers. Oh, you know what I need to do? I see why do something disappear that I'm not even clicking on. Ooh, the front suspension cross member B. Can I do it one more time? Did it go to 100%? Did that mean it went to 100%? Or does that mean it disappeared? I really don't know. I'm going to assume 100%. Well, no, you know what? If it fixed it to 100%, that would mean it wouldn't need to be on the repair bench. That means it's completed. So I'm going to assume it's 100%. So let's go over here and see. We go back to mount. Uh, where is it at? Front cross member B. Ooh, we fixed it to 100%. We fixed it to 100%, so we starting to get our frame right already. No, 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 I don't want that old. I don't want that old middle muffler there. Let's look at it, though. Let's let's, let's look at our handiwork. So look at our front suspension cross member B. Brand new chrome and chrome. We repaired that. We going all new with the parts. All new. So yeah, that saved me some money. I don't even know how much it costs, but I know it costs less than what we just paid. So tad out. How you like me now? I'm in the mix. What about this front? Oh, the front steering knuckles. Don't drag your knuckles. The bottom suspension on. Yo, you just don't know how cool this is to have no you just kind of repaired your own stuff. I don't even have to buy it. Some of the stuff I already had and I had already bought. But not that. And yeah, you know, this is my first build, so I got enthused. I probably would have went ahead and pulled the whole engine out. Bottom suspension arm. But because it was just, it was going and it was just feeling so good to be doing what we was doing. I just went ahead and started repairing the frame. With the ugly engine sitting right there watching. What we just telling the engine, engine, this is what we going to do with you. Bottom suspension arm. We going to do this for you, engine, so just look at it and observe. See if we get this clutch out of here. Get this clutch out of here. Oh, you know what? I didn't really have to take all that off. All I need to do is unmount that gear, but that's okay. What if it'll do it with it still in the air? No, it gotta be down. We shall lower it. We shall lower it. I'm the gun again. Oh, I pulled the engine out. I pulled the engine out for the first time. Look at that. No engine. No engine. Add engine into crate. Rotate engine. Let's see if it'll add it. Oh, it added it. The I4SO8C. Is that what this one was using? I believe so. I believe so. Yup, engine block. Look at it. Let's look at it for what it is. Cause yeah, I think this is just a regular I4. Okay, it's right side up. Sometimes they put it on upside down. We can rotate it though. Let's look at it. Let's look at it rotated. Ain't that cool? So you can see the bottom. Nice. What I'm gonna do while I have that there, uh, we'll move this for now. Uh, I'm gonna put it by the other car lift just to have it out the way. I just want to get everything that's in here out of here. Everything with our nice little neat frame. So we stripped everything. Now I don't know how to get rid of this though. Is there a way to get rid of the body? 
Is it just some bodies and not others? Somebody help me out. Y'all let me know. All right, so I found out that's some digging that I cannot uh, like restore this frame because I'm not on the level. I'm only on 16. I think I have to be on like 25 or 35. So, other than you know being able to replace certain components on the uh, the body, I'm gonna have to sell it as is. But that's okay. That's okay. We're gonna do that. So we're gonna keep working on this engine here. Take off all these parts. We just taking everything apart, everything apart. Oh, I gotta get this belt off the timing belt. Cool to be able to see it all close up. The cam shaft. I'm gonna throw the pistons. It's just a head. Crank shaft. Oh, the whole engine block is gone. It's gone, gone, gone. Engine block I four. I wonder can I repair that? Let's see what all we can repair once again. Oh, it either disappeared, okay. I think we were able to do the engine head. I mean the engine block. Yes, we fully repaired the engine block. Let's see the alternator. Okay, I don't have an alternator. Regular alternator, a water pump for the I-4. I-4. So let's get that. Let's get the alternator and the water pump. Alternator. Bam. Water pump. Oh, I fixed the water pump. I didn't need to buy it. Oh, man. That's all right. Oh, no, I didn't. I bought two. I'm tripping. I am tripping, tripping, tripping. Okay, fuel filter looking good, looking good. Yeah, engine head cover. Cool. Yeah, I wonder. If you know in the comments, let me know if I could have put the different engine head for the I-4 on there instead of just the plane. Cam gear. Do we have a decent working timing belt? No, we don't. Mission coil. Mission coil. Oh, I four MPI. So we need the I four MPI. We need a belt tensioner. Here yeah, we got some good belt tensioners. We'll get that. Get this intake manifold. Yes. Yes, yes, y'all. To the beat, y'all. No throttle. Fuel rail MPI. Got idle roller. Hey, 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 hey. Got the throttle, nice. You know the crankshaft pulley is good. Do we got a serpentine belt? No. Fuel rail MPI, good, good, good. All right, all right. Got the serpentine belt right. Serpentine belt A. Ah, we need another serpentine belt. Go ahead and put these spark plugs in. I need to put that. Oh, I hope it didn't put the wrong spark plug in. I need to put that quality one up in the warehouse. I don't even want to mistakenly use it. So we need that 
is serpentine belt A. Ignition wires for the I-4. Serpentine belt A. Serpentine belt A. Ooh, we could put them red ones on there. That's kind of funky. Oh, I could be putting some custom ones in here. Ooh, I think I will do that just, just so they'll be red. Just to get some spice, some flair to this. Oh, the intake manifold. What if I can go buy a cool looking intake manifold? I forgot they got the little custom parts shops now. Shop. Let's see, intake manifold. Now it's cool you do get these power boosted parts out of uh the crates. That's how I actually got those red wires. Oh, I could get the red ignition coils. I should need those. I think I need them for these. Okay, well they don't have the intake manifold. Ooh, yeah, they do. Yeah, they do, but not for the four cylinder. MPI. That's kind of hot, though. Oh, I can put the custom one on there. Uh oh, I'm going to let this one be. We'll get a little more jazzy on the next one. How about that? Catch me outside. We have rebuilt the engine. Nice. Let's look at this engine we rebuilt, y'all. Let's rotate it back up. Ooh. Ah. Ooh. My first fully rebuilt engine on the rack, on the stand. Look at that there. Look at that there. Pretty. With the red spark plug wires. Nice. Have to get a picture right there, like click. I gotta hit the stand. Rotate, rotate. Okay, take off a crane. Okay, cool. So now the crane's got it. Now the crane will install it back into the car. Oil dipstick. I ain't got the oil dipstick. I mean, it must gonna do that when I put it in there. Hundred percent everything. Look at that engine. Ooh. Nice. Needs to be on level 35 to actually uh, fix this body. So it's going to have a body looking rusty, but I'm going to fix all the doors and everything. It's just something we got to deal with right now. All my little niece and nephew are here. I got some twins, niece and nephews. They only three months. No, they out there. They they hungry. Out there with my sister. They so precious. Oh, I did fix that. Oh, I could use that one, but no. You know what? I got this pipe too. The front exhaust. Yep, I had bought some of these earlier. Didn't get brake pads though. Just the tires, and then all we gotta do is the uh, the body. Let's see. Ooh, look at that there! Look at that there! Fuel pump, oh, exhaust manifold. I got all that on the left spring plate. Oh, okay, U boat. Exhaust manifold, fuel pump. Let's go back and check this out. I thought we had that. Oh, we had to do it from the top. That's right.
we working it out. It's worth 19,000. Well, we almost there. All we need is the body. Oh, and some seats. Ooh, I wonder will it start? We ain't even tried to crank it yet. 350. Yeah, I think we'll go with this one. See if we can still keep this in budget. We got the hood. Left door. Left fender. Right door. Right fender. Bumper. Left tail light, right tail light, left head light, right head light. Oh, we're not gonna have enough. Cause I still need the glass. I might have to do a couple jobs off camera to get some more money. We finna move. You know what? No. I'm gonna put the uh, the start putting the body parts on right here. Left fender. Left door. Hood. Front bumper. If I get the rear bumper, I could just goes away when you in assembly mode. Oh, I didn't get the trunk. Oh, I got the tail lights though. Left tail light. There we go. Right tail light. So other than not being able to repair this rust of the body, I mean, I fully redid the body of the car. Ah, if I can get it on there, Lord, using the controller. Good night. All right, so we got everything hooked up. Normal mode. Okay, interior symbol. Ah. Okay, so I can. Dang, you need a stern wheel too? Okay. Oh, nice. I can have some, some mismatched seats. I got some leather. Assemble. Put that bad boy in now. That bad boy in now. We are finished. We are done. Go back to normal mode. We have fully customized our vehicle, y'all. We did it. I fully restored a vehicle. Fully restored it. So we, I can't uh, weld the body to fully clean up that rust, but everything else is fully restored. The engine. So the restoration bonus, I got 2000 a bonus 2000 I think I had about 15 when I started. So, yeah, off this full restoration, pay five for the car. And then put another 15, 16 in it. So I still made about 10,000. Close to 10 G's. That ain't a bad profit. That ain't a bad profit. And when you do better cars, you get better profit. And, that, and then I'm telling it the frame condition and the interior condition, which I don't understand why the interior condition ain't right. I fixed everything on the inside. But uh, I guess they still penalizing me for the actual frame all right well we're gonna go on and sell it and get our money back do you want your money back 
Yes, I do. Nice. Sold my first car. My first restore. So, yeah, for one of those old school, those classics, I should make way more money off of the restore. But, yeah, that ain't a bad. That ain't a bad uh, turnaround. Not a bad flip. So, yeah. So, I'm going to tally up the votes, and I'll either be doing that Camaro, the Corvette, or the Mustang GT. But we got our first restore done. Nice. And as we get up in our level, we'll be able to do more with the body. But I'm very happy about that. So leave me some comments, man. Leave me some tips if you got any tips, if you know of anything that I could have done that I didn't. And, um, yeah, just let me know what you think about that. Uh, custom restoration, all right? You can't see me. Car Mechanic Simulator 2018. You know what you must do above all things. Make your next move your best move, all right? Peace. You can't see me. Let's go. Thank you for checking me out at You Can't See Me TV. I'm You Can't See Me Gamer. Please like and subscribe to stay updated and check me out on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. All right. Peace.